Hello my loves, so right now I'm just kind of sitting in front of my mirror um, debating to get ready and what to do so I am going out for dinner and it's so cold right now like I am not naked and I'm wearing a beater and it's freaking freezing so that's when you know that like it's basically like winter or like fall or whatever it's freaking freezing here where i live and obviously the winter starts earlier here because i'm in canada but yeah so i'm sitting in my closet slash makeup area um as you guys can see i have a lot of my clothes behind me and yes i am planning to do like a finished vanity makeup uh room closet tour or whatever soon but i haven't been able to yet just because um, I have a few things I have to finish up here and it's really really messy behind you guys. There's like fucking shit everywhere So yeah, that's why I haven't got, gotten able to do that yet Upon some chapstick um, Yeah, it's like freaking freezing in here and Yeah, I just have to do like put on some makeup so I'm gonna do that I don't want to go too heavy or anything like that. So that'll be good. I already have like a little bit of makeup from earlier. Um, today was a really long day for me. I went around town, seriously. I went, I had class like all day. So I'm in my last, I had, it's Saturday today and I had class today. So guys, feel my pain. Um, but yeah, I had class today and it was like such a long class. I was in class for like eight hours. So eight hours every Saturday. Um, by the way, I'm using the Fenty Beauty um, foundation. So it's still doing good for me. I don't use it that often as I, as I probably, would like to because I just have uh, a lot of other foundations that I like to use like the Laura Mercier one um, But yeah, I thought I would just kind of film and have you guys talk with me. I mean, it's been a minute but yeah um, What was I gonna say? Yes, I had class today and then I went house hunting or not house hunting apartment hunting So me and the bay figured that since we can't buy a house right now because we, we looked at houses in the, back in the summer and they were really not in our price range and as of right now we decided that maybe you know a house is not a good time or it's not a good time for us to you know get a house just because you know it's just us two right now we don't plan on having a family right now or anytime soon and um well as of right now i don't know you know things every i don't want to say never things happen or whatever like the direction of your life changes in a moment like that but i mean as of right now of our plans we don't really have the enough funds or like it just wasn't financially right for us to get a house so you know we thought why don't we move um so right now i'm actually living in like basically a house but we want to move out because it's way too big for us but so we want to move back into an apartment because we we miss our apartment so much and we can't move back there because you know it, we rented it out and um we can't kick our tenant out he's amazing we love our tenant but yeah we want to find a new house to um a new apartment to invest in and you know look at look at different properties so we went to a few today and i love them they were all penthouses which i really like because the balcony was huge and yeah i mean like it was really really nice and i i really like it so i mean we have a few more to look at this week um so we're gonna do that and i mean yeah we're gonna figure things out just because things are just not really working for us here like we live in a huge place right now and it's only us two and it's kind of honestly creepy like i miss living on one floor together and this place we have right now is like three floors and it's just kind of creepy like i i sometimes i yell at him on the third floor and i hear noises here and there and i'm like it's only us two and i'm literally like what's going on like who who's here you know so yeah it just not didn't make sense i don't know why we moved into a big place so early but yeah that was just you know we didn't know but that's fine so oh by the way i'm using well my tart is out so i'm using nars um nars obviously the orgasm Literally, like, who doesn't use this, you know? So, um, I think I'm getting, like, sick. I'm not really sure because I have been getting, like, the sniffles. And this morning I woke up, I didn't feel good at all. By the way, this is the Bobbi Brown Golden Light number one. I love Bobbi Brown's um, bronzers. I feel like all of the bronzers I've tried, including MAC, MAC and Bobbi Brown are like the my go-to's. I've tried a lot of bronzers, guys. I like the Marc Jacobs blush and bronzer as well, but I don't know. They're such a very different shade. I feel like it's very dependent on your skin tone and everything and I would like like that. So yeah, I mean, I have a big week coming up. We're going to Jay-Z on Tuesday and that'll be really, really fun because I've never seen Jay-Z or Beyonce in real life and I that was literally my dream since I was like 14, like it was to see Beyonce. And I, I, went, I remember when she came here when I was like, 
uh, 18 or 17 and me and my ex-boyfriend tried to go but we didn't have enough money and you know I was like you know what whenever she comes back again like I have to go and you know now I'm older in my 20s I can afford Beyonce goals right <laughs> um anyways I'm in a really jolly mood today like what's going on I need to debating if I should wear lashes on top of my lash extensions I have lash extensions on right now and half of them are kind of falling off this one didn't this set didn't last as long as I thought it would I think I've been playing with my eyes too much like my eyes are not used to having lash extensions for this long I think I've been going on for like over six months and that's way too long like usually I take a break or I just don't get them for this six this long but you know I'm, I'm, I'm really loving them like I see my girlfriend all the time, we can get to catch up when we get my lash extensions done and um, I also get to get ready in the morning very quickly so I think I'm going to continue for the first time ever I usually take a break but I'm not going to continue um, we're just going to keep going oh my god, I dropped my I dropped my blow dryer anyways, yeah, we're just going to continue so yeah, that's what's going on um, but yeah, I'm thinking if I should wear lashes on top of my lash extensions. I kind of want to, but at the same time I don't because I just know that when you put on even more lashes, like it's going to rip anyways. So I don't think it's like worth it, but I mean, it would look nicer, but I would have a very hard time because it's, it's going to be really heavy. And my lashes right now are really thin, so I brush out my lashes all the time. <sighs> Can you guys like comment down below on what other videos you guys would want to see just because um, I definitely want to make more videos that you guys want to see and everything like that and I want to make content for that you guys you know that you guys would like and you guys would watch and I never want to do anything like boring and ungenuine so definitely let me know what you, what's the new trend or what you guys want to see um, you know do you guys like more iPhone videos I can definitely do those I love phones like obviously you guys know I um, I love talking about like manifestation and law of attraction, so I would definitely do that. Um, or how about school? Like I'm on my last semester of school, I can totally talk about my whole university or college experience. It's very, you know, super amazing. Um, but yeah, like there's a lot of things that I can definitely discuss. You guys just let me know and we can do them. I want to do more Q&As as well, so just leave questions, you know, wherever, I'll answer them in a video. Um, yeah, should I put lash extensions on? The struggle. Well, let's put on eyeshadow first. So, my favorite eyeshadow palette is a Tarte in bloom palette and uh, it's very very beautiful i love 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 this palette i feel like all of the colors are very very pigmented and um i think like i think i, I would literally wear like every color by the way halloween's like coming up what are you guys gonna do because i literally have no plans and i don't really want to do anything this year like i really want to just give out candy and um chill and watch you know football or like um youtube i don't know at home because oh my god a lash literally just fell off as i was doing my eyeshadow guys like my eye, this is like five, this is five dollars right here, okay? Like this lash. Guys, lash extensions are so, like, pricey. Oh, my god. Anyways, I need to do my nails again. Like, they're growing out, and I haven't had time to go. Um, I do have time, but I just haven't made a trip down there because it's kind of far where I live now. I used to live really close to it, and now I live, like, 30 minutes away, and I used to live five minutes. Oh, but, yeah. Um... Hopefully I'll be moved. I'll be able to move before the end of the year, and I can figure things out with my living situation. Should I wear lash extensions? I feel really naked without like lash strip lashes, but I feel like if I put on enough eyeshadow, I can get away with not wearing la la strip lashes today. I don't know. I never like would go out like this, like my lash. My lashes are really empty right now. It's probably because I keep I keep touching them and like. Oh, you know what? Maybe we'll make it darker, so that it looks like I'm wearing a little bit of like darker lashes. I don't know. Does this does that how it works? Okay, let's use leader. Bye. Uh, oh yeah, I got some exciting ass news coming up. I really want to tell you guys, but I'm gonna tell you guys save for another video. 
Um, it's gonna be amazing and you guys are gonna love it and it's gonna have like so many different changes in my life and in your life and just like a very impact and powerful, you know, thing. So Ow, I literally like clipped myself in the face. But... L'Oreal True Match Concealer because this is literally bomb and it's always been bomb like forever. How do you guys feel? How is the transition from summer to fall? How is the transition from where you live? Where do you guys live? What language do you guys speak? I love hearing like, I love reading like every single comment that you guys do because it's like amazing and you guys fascinate me and I like love you guys so much. My girlfriend's literally like on the way to pick me up right now and I'm like not even ready at all. I don't even know what I'm wearing. It's so cold outside. It's literally like, um, what is it called? It's not pouring but it's, it's definitely raining, kind of. And... Yeah, it's gonna be so cold. Like, what am I gonna do? I don't know what to wear. I got a little bit bronzer on my nose. Now I'm just straightening my hair. I need to go, like, tone my hair a little bit more. I made a hair appointment, hopefully, in next, next week or next week. I forgot when. I haven't done my hair since I left for Paris and oh my gosh guys, I miss Paris so much. Paris was bomb. Like if you guys have never been to Paris, please make that a bucket list or just please go. Like just book the ticket and just go. I was one of those people who always thought like Europe was never a thing for me. Like I can never go. It's so expensive. I can't travel there. Like I don't know how the Euro is and I would just be so unfamiliar and I have to do so much research and honestly I didn't do a single research guys. Like I just went and I booked the ticket and we just went and it was amazing and it was I've had the best time I've probably ever had on a trip and it was so like it was just breathtaking like every single thing that everything that you look at it was amazing so please if you've never been to Paris just please make the time to go this year or next year and you won't regret it I swear anywhere that you stay anywhere that you go within Europe like especially you know well I can only say for Paris because I've only been there and Monaco and you know, Rome, it was amazing, and yeah, I'm so lazy to like do my hair, like, I'm in that phase where I really just don't want to get ready anymore, like, I don't want to do anything, I just kind of want to stay home, watch movies, but I already made plans to go today, and I told my girlfriend, look, see, I'm sick, I'm such a good friend, I'm going out when I don't even feel well, um, I'm just kidding, <laughs> but I, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty, I don't know, I don't feel like 100% today, so, yeah. We'll see how it goes. Who knows? I have to wake up really early tomorrow. I have a lot of things to do tomorrow morning. Um, but yeah, so... <sighs> okay. My hair is not that straight, but it's fine, I think. I hate doing my makeup like when it's not really, really bright because it's very hard to see, but... A little bit more eyeshadow, just touch it, touch it. My nose is so freaking itchy. Okay, guys. This is my final half-assed look. Like, I barely did much. I mean, I, I kind of tried. Like, I don't know. I didn't put on extra strip lashes because... I don't know. I just don't... I'm not in the mood today. And hopefully I look decent or whatever. I feel like I'm a pumpkin sometimes. Because my face is such a pumpkin face. Like, I wish that it wasn't sometimes. But it's so annoying. Like... Bye. Anyways, let's go pick out an outfit and stop complaining and talking shit about myself. Um, so what am I going to wear? I'll probably wear pants just because... What is this doing here? I'll probably wear pants just because... 
it's cold as shit right now. Like, do you guys want to see outside? Like, it, look at it. It's like pouring rain. By the way, there's me in the bay just in the corner there. I didn't know where to put us, but yeah, that's a really cute photo. I don't know. Pretty sure I was wasted at that time because, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm going to wear pants. What pants should I wear? I don't know. Struggles of, let's try to find an outfit together. I know I just want to, like, not wear anything. So sometimes I just kind of stand here, literally not know what to wear, so just stare. I don't even know where my jeans are. Uh, guard. Maybe I can wear, like, jeans and Converse. Is that really scrubbed? I might have to do that. I just might have to do that. I don't know. So I decided on just a regular tank top and some jeans. Hello. Um, and then I'm just going to wear like a jacket, I think. Normal jacket. It's kind of cold, so I don't want to like dress up or anything. Just going to go dinner. Um, yeah, I don't have any other jackets. Yeah, I think this is good enough. What do you guys think? Just a, um, this, I forgot what it's called, jersey? No, it's not. <laughs> varsity, varsity type jacket, because it has like the stripe on the bottom. A beater, and then some jeans, and then I'll probably wear some Converse, just because it's freaking like freezing outside, and I don't want to wear heels, because heels is just gonna, it's gonna be too cold for heels. Oh, yeah, and obviously, probably wear my Chanel bag. So this is the completed look, very basic, but... Not too horrible, I guess. Like, what do you guys think? I like this normal look. I don't like to be like too dressed up, especially when we're just literally going to dinner. So I'm gonna go find the sock. I need more socks, guys. Like, where do you guys buy your socks? I know you have like one sock. Like, hello. Ugh. I need more socks, and my socks aren't even matched. Like, oh, I found matching socks actually. Okay. Anyways, I'm gonna head out now, guys. Nice talking to y'all. I love you guys so much. And then, yes, tour, quick tour. I love you guys so much. We'll talk soon. And yeah, peace out. Man,